Wow. I'm really disappointed. For the first time in this LP, I'm actually disappointed at Minecraft. Like, once again, I don't really know what I expected out of this. But, like, my envisioning of this was way more impressive than the actual thing. Yeah, I can't believe I just broke that. Okay, hello. Hello, what have we here? This is good. This is what I was looking for. An actual interior. Well, here we go. Okay, this is the another war room. Now, these rooms are farms for uh, another war which is required in potion making, so you need to have a lot of it. And what we're going to do... Yeah, let's get the shovel out and dig out this part of the floor. And I now have an idea as to what I will do with that other room I was thinking about building in the last episode. Okay. However, I will be sure to put some outside at least for looks, because I gotta have some, uh, just about everything out there, because I'm not worried about it. This is an actual nether fortress now. Oh, hello, what's in the center of this? Oh, a lava well! Yeah, okay. That's right. They do that. Okay. Well, finally, we get something interesting in this episode. Yep, and then a blaze spawner. Oh, who you can be. And I'll jump up here. Explore the rest of this fortress now. Because this looks like it'll be fun. A nice little adventure I'll probably split in the multiple segments. The 
This is a block path. I would like to do that. And this is a metal rack. It's okay because it tells you to stop on your head. myself I was able to find this level when it just didn't oh, heck. This would be a great place to fight gas. Seriously, if Nether Fortress didn't end in such a weird way, these would be nice places to make a base if you want to make a base in another. But like they twist and turn, and unless you're able to keep your head straight, you're going to lose your way more than once at least. And then what do you do? Which is why I'm setting up these torches this way. Okay, cool. Let's say. Some chance sitting in that chair. Oh, God. Alright, and there's a bunch of things you can do with the potions in this game. It's unreal. That's a cool one. Broken path that drops in the wall of my own. That's when it This, which is blocked. And I think we'll get it as far as I can here. So now let's just head back home. Because we got what we need. 
<laughs> That's cool. Okay. Oh. I can go back two ways. This is actually a user way. Okay. And here's how potions work. Um, uh, long bottles can stack. Potions cannot. So I'll bear this in mind. I've got so much stuff in this room there. What a pretty sweet trip though, I must say. I'm probably going to wind up having like a bunch of loot heads out here and everything. the glistering one. Ooh, spider's eye. Alright. That could be useful. Think. Crafting recipe allows me to get fermented spider eye, which is a very interesting This is right. I'm gonna find that crafting ass people. And I'm gonna make a couple potions in the next episode. You start it off. And we'll see how things go from there. Bye guys.